Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Loki, and I'm finally back with another Fate Grand Order video because it is the finals of the time to farm and so it is time for me to do the video. I haven't done any video on it because I've been super busy with a bunch of other stuff. May, may, mainly work. But I am here for the finals to grind it out a little bit. So that's going to be today's video. I hope you like it. If you want to tell me how you're doing on your grind, feel free. I have, I think, the basic five, but I'm going to be going till I think I have around enough to completely ascension my box. I honestly need more skill gems than I need um, anything else. So I don't really need statues, for example, and some of the materials that are found in the box I don't super need. So I'm really trying to get as much EXP as I can for the battle itself. And you can see here my setup, pretty basic setup for looping with um, Dantes. It works out for me, it's the quickest I have, it's the most consistent. If I had Atalanta, I would definitely use her. I would also, in the olden days before Quick was a thing, I used to do the setup where it was... I would have done Arash, blow up the first field, Ishtar, destroy the second, and then for the third, double waiver, and she's at 100% NP again. Or maybe one waiver, one Merlin, and then completely destroy the end row. Because uh, that is the one thing that's actually kind of a problem here, is that the end row of bosses are actually have a lot of HP, so you need a lot more than... You have to hit them with a lot more than one attack, I think. For two of them, at least. If my Dantes was just one MP more, I think I'd be in a better position. Or if he was actually a uh, quick saber. Uh, not quick saber, a quick um, bow. But my Atalanta is very low level compared to everything else, and she's not going to be able to kill the dudes at the end, so. This is the way it's going to be going for me. And again, it seems to work out pretty well. Let me see. Here. I could probably even switch out. I'm gonna try this. Alright, that works. Let me see, I think this lowers the fence as well. Just to be sure. No, it doesn't. Okay. I think this might work out, but it also might not. It might completely screw up everything. We're about to find out. It's not that big a deal. In the grand scheme of farming, it's kind of a big... Really? He died in one... I guess it's random whether or not he dies completely at the end there for me. But the last time I tried this, he definitely... Oh, hello, Paris. Also, I want to get everyone's bond up as quickly as possible. So there you go. 600. Let's go. Keep going. It is pretty simple. Simple, clean. Get in, get out. Boom, you're done. Bob's your uncle. And leave. And there's plenty of dudes who have been grinding non-stop. I usually save my grinding for the very end. And I am going to pick up those golden apples. I just don't want to do them right now. I don't really need anything from them but the golden apples. Power up, my boy. Make him as strong as possible. I also think you'll probably... I also wonder if my Scotty is going to... Um, what's the word I'm looking for that is escaping me right now? If she's going to get her bond up. There you go. Shut the deep! Doing well, yeah. Oh boy. Yeah, these, these grants can definitely get a little bit... Oop, no? Perfectly fine. We're doing pretty good, I'd say. It's a lot of this, so I like to watch a lot of movies. Right now I'm going through all the Iron Mans, because I, uh, I plan to see Shang-Chi on Tuesday. So, looking forward to that. So I'm kind of catching up with Marvel movies, because I have not seen all of them in a very long time. So I figure, hey, why not? And some of them I've never seen, like Captain Marvel and Black Widow, which is not out yet. Black Widow, though, is going to be coming to Disney Plus pretty soon. If, if our movie did not release with a big, first of all, big ass premium, and second of all, during a pandemic, I would definitely have watched it, but it's a real shame on that one. So I'm looking forward to that. Right here. All right, I'm going to see if he, if it happens again. And see if the middle survives. Oh, you got this boy. You can destroy his ass. 
Come on! Okay, he's dead. Perfect. Though I don't think this actually kills... No, he's gonna survive. Okay. It's fine. I wanted to test it. It actually would take more time for me to completely reset the app than just go in here and kill him like this super easy. He should be dead here. Yeah. With a crit to the death. But yeah, I, I, yeah, this is good for just putting something on in the background and just kind of watching and doing your 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 stuff. That's my golden apple amount right now, in 300s. Again, I do want to save some for the next one coming with Christmas. Because I think I actually, at this point, need skill gems more than I need anything else. Plenty of units I want to level up. Skills for. But I usually hesitate because I want money or something. Also during this, I do <laughs> turn off the sounds. <laughs> I'm sure it would get on my nerves very quickly if I heard this all the time. Well, this video is perfectly fine. I also have to make sure to do some other stuff and some of my other gotchas. This is a very unfortunate time because I've been also building up Dragali in the background for a bit. Mm. Use a little bit of that. Yes, I'll go with this. I think we'll be fine here. But yeah, I've been keeping myself busy. Doing a bunch of... I made that other alternate Yu-Gi-Oh! channel with Zen, which is a lot of fun. I still try and keep up with everything. I always feel bad whenever I don't make enough Fago stuff, because I'm sure there's plenty of people who follow me just for Fago. And I would love to make more stuff, but the stuff I want to do with Fago, I really want to think it out a little bit before I do it. And sometimes the content uh, release schedule for Fago makes it so it's actually pretty easy for me to advance forward, but at the same time I also just play the game. Oh, that's how he's been surviving. You fuck. I see how it is. Okay, I'm gonna go like this. Occasionally, he doesn't get hit by the defensive buff because he's a god. And that's how he's been surviving it at least once. Now let's see if this is enough. What a dick thing for them to add in the middle, by the way. A dude that can just occasionally say nope to your nonsense in terms of getting a debuff. Ooh! Please tell me it's a grind C and not a damage C. Hey, let's go. A couple more of those and I'll be able to up my grinding and helping out my friends as well by getting a two of these. Uh, do -do -do -do. Sometimes I don't really think about it. I just pick whoever's at top and see if they have a one or a two. I feel, always feel bad. I should really pick occasionally the ones with one in it, but seriously, if there's... Uh, is there's a Scotty on page one and they have a one or they both have one, I will gladly pick them. It's just been at this point, they've all had two, so I haven't had a problem with it. In general, you should always be thankful for your friends. For in life and in Fago, when they keep up with their sport lists, you guys are the true MVPs. I always feel like, even for the people who feel like, eh, no one uses my friend list, I like it that you do that. I like it that you put effort into it, and your effort is... Shown back here by me telling you, I think you're doing great. I'm like, I'm like Steve from Blues Clues. I like what you're doing here. What you got a bunion with a uh, bronze, uh, bronze level material drop? I love it. Thank you so much for actually taking the time to give her something. In case there is someone out there who doesn't play three turns, because there's plenty of people who don't play three turns. Are you kidding me? And they would love it for them to have. They would love to have all the options in the world available to them. And I thank you very much for taking the time off of your day to support your buddies in that way. Paper with glasses. <laughs> Don Tess always has such fun. That's why I like using him so much. Besides the fact that he looks rad. I think I accidentally hit the, the, the yeah, I did. Alright, let me see if I can fix this. Alright, hit the stop record button. Uh, well, alright, that's basically the end of the video, because OBS decided to just completely fucking crash on me. Until next time, everyone, you guys have a good day, and I'll see you guys in the next video. I don't know what happened here. This is dumb. But hopefully you enjoyed the video. <laughs> good grinding, everyone. Goodbye.